When there's no more hope is left in me I can see what comes my way Good morning, you guys. How y'all doing? I hope everybody's doing good. Uh, I was going to do this video yesterday and didn't get a chance, so I thought I'd hop on and do it now. Uh, went to Walmart yesterday and picked up a few things. I'll finish my grocery shopping probably on Friday, but I needed some things for Hayden. And so, let me show you what I got. It, it's not much. Uh, I found these tortillas uh, gluten-free. I hadn't been able to find any, but I found some. These were $3.97. I actually found some gluten-free donuts. These were $5.96, I believe. And uh, then I found Hayden her garlic knots. These are really hard to find. The shelves usually are empty. Uh, I haven't been able to find her garlic bites in over a year. So I guess they quit selling them. But uh, I found these. These were $2.98. I got her two Jack pepperoni pizzas, thin crust. She likes these. And these were $3.62. She eats, like, when she comes over and spends the night, she'll either have me make her a pizza, or she'll have garlic bites, garlic knots. And then, if she has some of her pizza left, she don't want to eat it. She wants something different. So, I have to have different stuff all the time. So, um, I got those. And then I picked up some of this Afran. This stuff was $9.97. Crazy. I found me these gluten-free uh, oatmeal cookies also at Walmart. These were $3.97. Thought I'd try them. I think I had these in Florida. Excuse me, y'all. I think I had these when I was down in Florida, but I'm not, I don't remember for sure. But I got those. And then I try to keep Hayden um, melatonin for sleeping. So I bought two jars, one for backup and then one for use. Uh, I had one and she took it home with her. <laughs> so she's afraid mommy will run out even though mommy had some. She don't want to take a chance, so... I told her, go ahead, and so I, I bought two this time. And those were $9.97 each. So, not too bad, because they last a while. I, I use these also when I have a, a sleepless night. And then I picked up some AIM toothpaste. My husband uses this. Uh, I think he uses this on his partial. Anyway, he uses it. That, that was all I got at Walmart. Then we went over to um, uh, Myers in uh, Stevensville, which isn't too far from where we live. Uh, we had we picked us up a pizza at Domino's, and we ate that in the park, which was down from Myers because the park is on the beach. Well, on the lake. It's not really on the beach, but it's on the lake. And after we ate, we we went down to the Meyer store. And I found me a Mountain Zevia, which is like a Mountain Dew. It's really good. And I found the Cola Zevia. They had them on sale for $4. And, uh, let's see. not that. I wanted to see. I can't remember. I think it was $4.49, but if I say that, it'll probably be wrong. Uh, yeah, it was $4.49, and because of their program, they have like an awards program uh, and on their app, and I got $2 off of my 
shopping. So instead of ten dollars and something, I only gave eight dollars and some change for for twelve. So that's not too bad. Pop is expensive, and especially if you're buying like a like uh, sugar free. This is made with stevia, and so it makes it uh, better for you. No pop's good for you, but it's better than regular soda or the sugar-free with aspartame. I'm not allowed to have aspartame, so, you know, anything is better than nothing when you want something cold and you don't want to just drink water. And since I am trying my best to get healthy, uh, I try not to drink a whole lot of soda, regular soda, but I do drink it. Because that's the good thing about what I'm doing now is I eat or drink whatever I want when I do eat. And when I, you know, uh, during my, uh, what I call fasting time, which is what it is, I drink water and uh, black coffee. If, but if I do want to sweeten my coffee any, I use monk fruit, but I I'm trying not to, and I don't drink a lot of coffee. I just mostly have a cup of coffee in the morning when I get up, because that's when I really want my coffee. Like, uh, I would say, right now, because <laughs> it's early. Uh, I got up early. My husband is gone walking, and I woke up and couldn't sleep, so... It's like five to five twelve in the morning, believe it or not. <laughs> but I needed to get this video done because this stuff's been sitting on my counter. All but the frozen stuff, of course, that was in the freezer. But the other stuff's been sitting here waiting for me to do my video. So now that I did my video, I'll get it all put away. So I'm going to get off of here. Don't forget our prayer request. I should have put that in the beginning of the video, and because it's early, like I said, there's going to be days I forget to do it in the beginning. And um, we have several requests. Uh, I will be going over them in more detail, but just pray for uh, Donna, April, um, Texas, um all the places that need rain, you guys, and all of the people who have been affected by these storms and sudden floods and stuff, uh, pray for them, uh, for lost members. A lot of people have lost family members. Um, I'm trying to think. It's early. Um, pray for Linda and... Linda Underwood and her husband. Um, and then pray for each other. For, you know, the ones on our YouTube channel and um, family and and our group, our Facebook group family. Just, just pray for each other. Because we all have prayer requests. And sometimes we don't want to share what our needs are but God already knows them so just pray for each other all right you guys I'm going to get off of here I'm going to put this stuff away and I'm going to go have my coffee uh and I'll catch you guys in my next video don't forget to say a little prayer for me smile and be kind to those you meet kindness can go a long ways and God bless each one of you. Love you so much. Thank you for joining my channel and being with me. And if you're new to my channel, welcome. I hope you stay with me. And I'll catch y'all later. When there's no more hope is left in me, I can see what comes my way.